Happy Saturday! I am just leaving work in my weird outfit and there is quite a bit of things that I need to do. It is one o'clock. I've got some shoes in the back that are not mine. I've been sent on a mission from my coworker from my main office. I'm in the Edina office right now. So I'm like really close to Maple Grove, like closer than normal. So I'm gonna go exchange these shoes for my coworker. I'm gonna go to Home Goods because Home Goods is right next door to DSW where I need to exchange the shoes. And then I'm gonna go to Trader Joe's as well. So me and my nice pimple right here, he like goes like that. So freaking gross. Are gonna go on an adventure. So Emily and the pimple, we're going on the adventures today. So I was at DSW. Now I'm going there. So I found this thing. I'm normally like not into color, but look how cute that wreath is. And it's like, like paper or something. It's only 20 bucks. I don't know. I don't know if I should get this. It's cute though, right? Okay, so I finally found a quiet corner. I'm gonna get this thing. It's a big framed, it's not even a print. It's like a magnetic board. Like, those are magnums right here. Weird. Um, found some neutral holiday towels for the bathroom downstairs. So I thought that'd be cute. These are like little tea or like tip towels and then just regular ones. And then I found this thing. But I figured I'd put like blankets and pillows in this. And I love the rope detail. It's like obviously like faux leather. And then it's got like little grommet, not grommet, what are they called? Silver things. Studs. Uh -uh. So it was $59 and now it's $39. So I think that's kind of a good deal. And this thing is huge. It's hard to see. Like it doesn't even fit in the cart. Like it's sitting on top of my purse. By the way, my purse is like the same color, so pretty sure I like the same colored things. I got problems. So that's what I'm gonna get at the home goods. Okay, y'all. So I got my basket, which I'm super excited about. And my zit is excited about it too. But I'm going into Trader Joe's. You can't really see it very well. And I'm hungry. So it's like the worst thing. I'm probably gonna buy like $200 worth of groceries, like for realsies. I. Mm, Anyway, okay, oh, someone's parking in front of me, fuck. Okay, all right, bye. <sighs> okay, so I'm back. Trader Joe's wasn't that bad. Um, a lot of people, like, there's a reason why I go grocery shopping on like Tuesday evenings because oh, it gives me like major anxiety. Like, just, there's too many people and I just can't handle it. So, anyway, um, I got three bags of this, the, uh, Mandarin orange chicken because it's freaking delicious. And then I got some caramel popcorn because I remember I got this last time I was here, which was like several months ago, and it was really good. So I'm gonna get it again. And then I got these pumpkin seed things for my coworker, the same one that's, you know, about the shoes. Oh my god, oh my gosh. Hold on. I just need to get my bag. And then I got these. These are my favorite crackers. I got quite a few of those. And then, all the way on the bottom. This is also for my coworker, this apple cranberry tart thing. I don't know. It's apples and cranberries and warm spices nestled in a flaky pastry crust. Well, anyway, that's that. So, I'm gonna finally get going home. Um. So yeah, I'm gonna finally go home and do home things, but it's very exciting that I'm like out in the world. I never I never take you guys out in the world anymore. I need to work on that. So it is uh, currently like three o'clock or something. I still haven't eaten anything yet today. Um, yeah, I was gross and I had a Coke earlier. That's been it, so yeah. I So I need to eat something, but I think, I don't know. I think I might just wait till I get home, but then I'm like, gonna eat all the things, but maybe that's just what I should do. Well, hello, hello, and welcome to Monday. So, let's talk about Sunday, okay? Whoa, that was intense. Um, all right, so I filmed on Sunday, and it was like a one take kind of a deal. Guess who forgot to hit record? This one right here. 
So I'm a dumb dumb. Apologize. And I also didn't even say goodbye on Saturday. Like, what is up with me? I'm like having all the vlogging issues. So, anyway, it is Monday. It is 6 p.m. If you can see that there, maybe you can see it. I don't know. It's kind of far away. So, I am now going to unload the dishwasher and, uh, do some things but i figured i would actually answer a couple of questions because i've been getting some interesting questions on the instagram and uh yeah so i think the question i really wanted to answer is someone oh goodness gracious um sorry i'm like looking at a picture of a text message so someone had asked me if i was still planning like i normally had been like setting up my week the answer is kind of no um i do kind of set up my week like a week or two ahead of time and then i've been filling in like as i go so some of it has to be done after the fact just because i don't really know what's going on on any certain day but um, I'm spending like dedicating like, you know, anywhere from five to however long minutes every day to the planner and just kind of figuring out what happened that day. And then also if there's anything new I need to put in the calendar, like I made an appointment for, I have actually two appointments in November that I need to put in my calendar. So I think I'm going to do that tonight. Um, but yeah, so it's just kind of like I'm just doing it as I go and I've been really really enjoying it I know I've said this like a million times on Instagram no, on not on Instagram on YouTube on these vlogs, but I have been posting a lot more on Instagram and Facebook and um, The links are always below if you guys want to watch or not watch but you know follow me there But um, I've been really enjoying a lot of the stickers that I have and have had for quite a while and um, I'm discovering like new shops too. So it's been kind of fun to not mention just like the, my staple like three or four shops and that's it because that's kind of what I had been doing because those are kind of like my go-to standards. But there's lots of other great shops out there and um, I'm excited that I can actually use some of my stickers that I've purchased or that have been given to me um, or I've gotten in giveaways and racks and things like that. So anyway, but yes, I have been really enjoying that. So. Yes, to answer your question, yes, ish, yeah, whatever. It seems like you guys are enjoying the planner spreads a lot more on Instagram, because um, I'm kind of reading um, reading along with your comments, saying that you're enjoying that, and um, way more interesting than my boring ass plan with me is, which I agree, my plan with me is were really boring. And uh, no, I don't know what my plan with me's are gonna look like moving forward or if I'm even gonna do plan with me videos. I will do planner related videos, don't get me wrong. I don't know, I haven't made any decisions yet, but I have some things kind of bouncing around in my weird little brain of mine, so. But anyway, I am going to get started on emptying this dishwasher and making a little bit of dinner for myself, and then I'm gonna maybe jam on the planner for a little bit, and uh yeah that's that's what's happening so i'm kind of excited to have nothing to do tonight <laughs> it's so exciting not doing anything you guys it's so nice it's just so nice to like <whistles> clear the mind i have a few emails i need to send um to my old employer's email in like a few minutes but i figured i would do that while i was just you know warming up stuff or having stuff in the oven or whatever i don't even know what i'm gonna make yet so um yeah i'm gonna send some emails and get to making some dinner so i'll check in with you guys in a little bit yo 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 it is many hours later and it's time to go to sleep like very soonish but i need to give the dog some more water i don't like him drinking water right before bed but he won't because he's upstairs sleeping i just noticed i was not doing the right thing and being a bad doggy mom and I realized probably it just looked like I pissed myself but I didn't I swear I did the Brita I don't like to pee on camera you guys I'm a little camera shy okay but yeah so that is what's happening y'all and uh yeah I've got to oh, I have to open some of my mail I like have most of my things filling up more water don't worry I'm not pissing I'm not pissing y'all um I have like a ton of my 
bills and stuff on like auto so I already like know what <laughs> everything is every single month for the most part but I don't like open all my mail because I don't care to <laughs> I just open it and then stack it on a pile because yeah at you, the Emily you think is super organized I still haven't <laughs> figured out like a good organizational system for all of my like paper bills and stuff I don't really want to keep them but then I feel like I should keep them because if there's ever like an emergency or something I don't know what of that emergency would be but like I would have to like know my account number or something but you know most of the time they just ask you your information you give it to them and then magically things happen so I don't know Long story long, I just haven't figured out a good filing system. So I'll get to that at some point in my life. But yes, I uh, did a little bit of planning, which I won't show you yet because there's other like things, whoa, there's other things happening um, in the next couple of weeks that I would rather keep private until they actually happen because you know, gotta keep the suspense going guys. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna leave my water bottle out, but I need to go and see the dog because we need to do a Doyle challenge. Where's the doggy? Where's the doggy? Oh, by the way, I put these like big ass gourd pumpkin things up here a while ago. I think I kind of like it. Um, got them at Marshall's, TJ Maxx, Home Goods, somewhere. Somewhere like that. I don't know. Somewhere along in my adventure travels. Where's the dog at? Uh oh, he's not in here, which only means he's in the creepiest room ever. <sighs> Joy all. He's so creepy when he's in here and it's like pitch black. Hold on, let me turn you around. What's up, Doyle? Here, let's first scale. This is what it looks like when you walk in here. <laughs> Just a lump. Hey bud, what's going on? <laughs> he loves that this comforter is up here and I have not <laughs> put anything on it. He just wants to be all lumpy in it. Yes, you do, buddy. Yes, you do. Oh my goodness, sir. Oh my goodness, sir. So what's new, Doyle? Your friends have been missing you. Yeah. Yeah, they've been missing you and your weird paws. Yeah, I know, right? Um, so anyway, Doyle and I are gonna go for the evening, but thank you guys so much for watching Monday's Vlogtober. He clearly needs to get more comfortable with life, like for realsies. Anyway, hey Doyle, you wanna go outside? You wanna go on a walk? Do you wanna go outside? You wanna go on a walk? Buddy. Oh, somebody wants to go on his walk. You know why? Because he gets cheese when he goes on his walk. Oh, yes, I know. Oh, can you get off of me? Sir, sir, sir. Oh, God. It's like, he's so uncomfortable sometimes. He just like digs his pokey little paw like into my leg. It's very... You're, you're hurting your mother. It's like he doesn't care. He doesn't even care. Do you care? That's a no. All right, so anyway, we are going to Jet. Thank you guys so much for hanging out and I will see you guys and Doyle will also see you guys in the next vlog. My gosh. You gonna say goodbye? That's a no. So it is Tuesday. We are on a walk. And the sunset looks kind of cool. I mean, unfortunately, Oh, it's probably gonna be all windblown. Darn it. Isn't that a pretty sunset today? It's so cute. Well, hello and welcome to Vlogtober. It is Tuesday. I already said hello, kind of, because I was outside. Hopefully some of that footage came out because it is super windy, like Fargo windy out today. And I don't have like a little fluffy thing on my mic. So I don't know if it came out, but if it didn't come out with the audio, I probably laid some music over it. So anyway, um, yeah, so I am home a little later, seven o'clock. 
and just got in from outside and my ears are like bright red because it's cold and um went to a target and i needed some like doyle dog stuff so i figured i'd show you what i got i got him some allergy pills he takes two of these a day these are all vet recommended things so don't worry down in the comments if you've got comments about it his vet recommends these things and then um he actually takes a fish oil tablet just one of these a day and the reason he takes the allergies is because he he licks he, well he's a licker He's a liquor. And then um, I actually just got rid of my one can of pumpkin that I had. It like helps Doyle's tummy if he's like throwing up or like has an uneasy stomach. But I needed to get another can of pumpkin because that one is like expiring soon. I actually donated it to like a food shelf. It's donate or it's not donating. It's expiring in a couple of months. But I figured I would just get a new one because this is canned pumpkin season. So I just got the market pantry one and this is good till 2020. So yeah, so I have this and that's what's going on so far. I need to eat a little bit of dinner and I am going to do that in just a moment. But before I do that, it's time to water the plant. So let's do this thing. I like for my mother to have on record that I am actually watering her damn plant that I don't like, but it's here. So I'm watering it. Look at all the water. I still don't like plants. I'm gonna keep saying that for the entire vlog. I just, ugh. P.S. There's like a plant at work that I'm gonna have to start to take care of after the gal that's going on maternity leave like goes and has her baby. Not looking forward to that either. But anyway, I turn this light on too because it's like pitch black outside now. Ooh, that looks funny. Um, so yeah, but that is a, uh, ooh, someone's texting me, almost the super popular. But yeah, I am gonna run and eat something. I'm not running, I'm running to like the fridge or whatever. I don't know what I'm gonna eat yet. But yeah, so I will check in with you guys in a little bit and I think I'm gonna jam on the planner, kind of like last night, and uh, just hang out because why not, you know? It's, it's good to hang out. Plus I'm really, really cold. Like my face is like super cold. So time to warm up the cheekers. Hello. Today is a weird vlog because it is Wednesday and it's evening time. I still have a little bit of makeup on, but I figured I get a lot of questions about like, I don't know what I do for my skincare, which I haven't been doing a lot for my skincare. I mean, recently, recently I've actually been doing more, I should say because I went to Sephora, was it last week? And uh, got a bunch of stuff. And I just like need to get more into my skincare. So I know this is kind of weird, but I'm like putting my hair up in like this weird, like big old ponytail loop thing. I don't know, it just like makes my life feel better. But I figured I would kind of show you just what I use. I'm gonna do something kind of fun. I'm gonna use one of my masks. This is what I take my initial makeup off with, which is the Up and Up Refreshing Cleansing Towelettes. I've tried many versions of that, and um, the Target brand, I feel like, works the best. So, yeah, I just preliminarily take my makeup off. And to be completely honest, like, I just, do this for sure every night, <laughs> but I don't always use my like clear sonic, which I wish I would use it more. I'm gonna use it tonight, but I don't know, like something about like the end of the day and just not caring. <laughs> I don't know. So yeah, and um, my face is always like really red when I touch it, so it gets really, really red. Um, and I kind of jam on it too, which is probably like not the best thing for it, but whatever. Yeah, so just remove the makeups. And then I'll use my Clarisonic in a minute. But I want to show you guys the mask thing I got. Totally not sponsored, by the way. Like, I get comments like that all the time. Not sponsored by anybody, I promise. But this was a recommendation from my friend Kayla that actually works at Sephora and it's all their like masks. So I got a face mask, an eye mask, hand mask, foot mask, lip mask, and a hair mask. Well, I think I might do the eye mask tonight because 
My eyeballs are like kind of puffy. So let's bust this baby open because I'm excited. Let's see. Ooh. Ah. Come here. Oh my gosh. They're like all stuck together. Come on. Oh my gosh. There's like adhesive. You guys see that? There's like adhesive on the back of all of these. Okay. Well, I'm gonna put the rest of these back in here because the adhesive is gonna get stuck on everything. <laughs> That's like those little glue dot things. All right, now everything's back there, minus the eyeball mask. So I'm gonna put this in my little closet over here. And don't judge me, this closet is not organized at all. All right, I'll just like, like slip it in you can't like really see what's going on in there all right so i have a new cleanser but um to be honest i haven't used it yet and i'm just kind of trying to use up this it's my cetaphil cleanser i get the normal to oily skin and i really really like it especially with the clarisonic love this thing this is my clarisonic mia 3 which is amazing so i'm gonna wash my face and then i'll be right back all right i officially wash my face Ugh. And uh, this lighting is like super harsh in here, but whatever. It's a bathroom. Um, so yeah, so wash my face with the Clarisonic. I don't know why I don't just like take the five minutes to actually wash my face with the Clarisonic. Cause it's like super satisfying, by the way. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I feel like, oh, it takes too much time. Like, I want to go to bed. <laughs> but... I'm sure some of you out there can relate to that. But, okay, so let's read the directions on the eye mask of if I can like moisturize before or put this on and then moisturize after. I'm not really, I'm not too sure. It says, remove the, oh, oh, let's see here. It doesn't say. Well, it doesn't say, but um, I'm just gonna go with, cause it tells me to remove the protective film from both of the white fiber patches, which I'll put on my I'll put underneath my eyes. And then it says, position the patches underneath the eye area as shown as the diagram, which is right here. And then it says, leave them on for 15 minutes, then remove them gently, and then massage any excess product into the skin. So actually, you know what I'm gonna do first? I'm gonna tone first, and then I'll use this. This have obviously some moisturizer or something in it, and then I'll put moisturizer on my face afterwards. So, right behind you guys is this. This is my body shop tea tree stuff. I'm like almost out. I need to get more of this. Just haven't yet. Like all the things are behind you guys. And, update. Here's my zit. It's so irritating. It's like irritating as like a 36 year old. Like, am I done with the breakouts? Like, seriously? I mean, I should be thankful, like, I don't really, like, get bad stuff. And, like, I've got, like, this little spot right here. It's hard to see in this light because, like, this, the camera is, like, so blown out. But, I don't know. I guess I shouldn't complain. But it's, like, I thought I was over, like, all that middle school, high school acne and, like, I don't know, I thought I was over it, but apparently I'm not. So, yeah. And I don't use eye makeup remover because I just wear a little bit of mascara. But this seems to get rid of any of the excess junk. So yeah, okay, now I may eye makeup. Wow, no eye mask. And it's the rose eye mask if you guys are interested. Whoa, oh, it's like, it's like super moisturized on my hand already. Whoa, alrighty then. It's like really goopy. So it says to remove the back, but I don't think there's a back. Like, I don't know. Is this right? Like, how do I do it? Does it go like, no, it doesn't go like that. Oh, I should look at the diagram. Oh, how is there a peely thing? 
Oh, they're both on this one, okay. So this one's like super stiff and this one's like all like loosey-goosey. This one, they both peel off. Oh, I see, okay, it does like look like a Nike swoosh. Okay, so you're supposed to go like this and then like that. Oh God, this feels so weird. Arr. All right, oh, I see. You're supposed to get like your like little crow's feet and stuff, so. Oh, I look amazing. Oh God, don't look down because it's going to get you. All right. And what did I say? 15 minutes? All right. So, whoa. My Nike swoosh. All right. I'm going to use my mirror here. Well, you know what I kind of like about this? Is I don't feel like if I, like, you know, move my head around, that it's not going to, like, fall off my face. I've had other like sheet masks and stuff before where you like literally have to lay down for like, you know, the 15 minutes or whatever it is. So cool. Well, I'm excited about this. <sighs> and um, I'm not going to keep you guys for 15 minutes because it's like crazy town. But I will put on, after this is like over, I will put this on. This is my tea tree blemish fade night lotion and I get this from the body shop as well it's the same line as this guy and then after that so I like go between two different moisturizers but I think well I'll show you the moisturizers I usually use so this is the L'Oreal age perfect night cream and then once in a while as a little luxury I use this this is the Carez wild rose salvage I don't know what it says. It just says Carez Wild Rose. Oh, Advanced Brightening Sleeping Facial. Smells amazing. I think I'm gonna put this on tonight because this is kind of rose scented too. And then um, if you guys watched my Sephora haul, which I did in the last vlog that was posted um, currently, like while I'm filming this, because I think there's gonna be a vlog or two that'll go up before this one, I'm not really sure. I got another evening like moisturizer and that one is, I think tea tree scented as well, but I haven't tried that one yet, but I'm going to probably try that this weekend. So anyway, this is gonna be it for the vlog today because I feel like I've talked a little too much. Oh, look, look, I even look more amazing. Oh, you can see my zit like so much better and my weird little thing that I was talking about. Like it just like popped up and I'm like, what is this thing? And like there's a couple little things over here. I'm like, what the hell? Like, I'm not 16 anymore. I don't understand. So I don't know where the dog is. Let me let me try to find the dog. Nope, not in here. <gasps> He's in his room, you guys. Y'all ready for this? Hey Doyle, what are you doing? What are you doing, bud? What are you doing, buddy? Oh, look at that cute little man with that cute little plant. It's Doyle. It's Doyle. I swear, he just loves to lay on that thing. It's like a cloud of fluffy softness, and he lays on it every evening. And sometimes I catch him on it in the morning, too. So he's just a goofball. But anyway, I think I'm gonna let you guys go for today. Tomorrow, I have some really fun things going up on the vlog, or not going up on the vlog, but happening on the vlog so I am actually going to download all my footage like while I'm getting my eyeballs done here and then change up my battery because I'm actually going out on the town tomorrow I don't know why I did that like the like Wendy Williams like how you doing <laughs> but um I'm probably not gonna show the people but I will maybe like show the drinks or I don't know I'll do something because that's like a rare occurrence you guys it's like really rare so anyway, um, Doyle and I are gonna go and I will see you tomorrow. Bye guys. Happy Vlogtober, it is Thursday. I'm currently at some like really random bar and um, I didn't vlog anything inside cause everyone was just kind of like hanging out. So um, if you guys wanna see my one glass of wine I had, you can check out my Instagram down below. Um, I'm gonna Instagram that before I leave here today. But um, yeah, it was really fun to, uh, see everybody outside of work and then also um some of their spouses came too which is kind of cool but this place is like really really close to um 
the office so kind of worked out slick but it's okay to blow off a little bit of steam have some fun with some friends sit for a long long time which I did sit for quite a while and um, have a little bit of appetizers and go from there so I will uh, see you guys when I get home so this is happening it's snowing and it makes me sad Ugh. it's like in my face yep It's October, you guys. TGIF, by the way. Doyle and I are walking. Just trying to find the most perfect place to poop. And, ugh. You know, the snow, I don't like it. But the wind, whew, the worst. This dog is on a pooping protest. Update. The dog won't poop. Update, I'm back inside. There's still snow on my jacket. There's snow on the dog. He's all wet. I'm all wet, look at that. Look, there's freaking snowflakes in my hair. Gross! Why is it snowing? It is October! <sighs> and the wind, ooh. Me and the wind gotta have a conversation because no thank you. I am also, side note, wearing for the first time my version of an ugly Christmas sweater that has snowflakes on it because it was supposed to snow today. I got it at Target, by the way. Oh, do you guys see? Can you see this? Do you see that? Ugh, snow, get out of my mouth. Oh, so gross. Um, it's time for Doyle's treat, so. And do you see my neck? That's from the wind. Ugh. I'm definitely, treat for the dog. Treat for the dog. Whoop, better get it, yeah. I'm definitely having something warm for dinner tonight. I don't know what it is. I don't care what it is. It just needs to be nice and hot. Cause, ew, and gross. Fun fact, tomorrow, I think most of the snow is going to be gone by tomorrow even though it's supposed to snow for like the entire day today. But my pants are all wet right here. So I'm gonna change my pantalones and have some dinner and then I will be back to check in and tell you guys all of the weird comings and goings of Emily and Doyle's life. And oh, I think I need a towel for my hair because oh my gosh, and it's so cold. Ugh. Now I'm just complaining. Okay, I gotta go. All right, I'll be back, bye. Well, hello my friends, it is several hours later. I have been hanging out watching some Stranger Things, but I'm only on season one because I just started watching it like this week, I think. Um, but yeah, so it's what's been going on. Doyle has joined me for some Stranger Things action. Uh, little review on Stranger Things. I'm on episode five. The first episode? Like, didn't really grab me, but I've heard so many things about this show that I was like, you know what? I'm gonna give it two episodes for me to like get into it. And then I got a little into it, so yeah. What do you think, Doyle? Do you like it? He just keeps wedging himself, because I put my legs up here. He like keeps wedging himself behind the back of the sofa. The back of the sofa. Wow, Doyle. And uh, my legs, because that's just like what he does with his life. What's going on? Hey, today's Friday, Doyle. You know what that means? It means tomorrow I get to sleep in. And that's very exciting for me. Are you going to let me sleep in? Are you going to let me sleep in? That would be a no. He still wakes up. Well, my alarm goes off anywhere from 5 a.m. to 5.30, just depends on like weather and stuff. But anyways, so he, his little internal puppy clock, uh, wakes himself up about 5.30 every day. So, um, you know, it happens. Anyway, well, I'm gonna say good night to the vlog. This is what I do all day. He is so judgmental. He, I mean, he just sits here and judges my face, so. Whatever. Just
just like the internet, right? Hey. So anyways, well, I'm going to say goodnight to the vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you guys tomorrow for more Vlogtober. Um, tomorrow, I think I'm just going to hang out here by myself and a Doyle dog. And I don't think I'm going to do too much. Oh, I'm yawning. Oh, anyway, okay. All right, I'm really going to go. I'm going to watch one more episode of Stranger Things. And then I'm going to bed. And I'm going to bed early, by the way, because it's like not even nine. So as soon as this episode is over, like 40, so it's 43 minutes, I'm going to sleep.